This is a physical balance. Today we are going to weigh something and see how a physical balance works. These are the two pans and it is pivoted. The arms are equal. This particular thing which is hanging is the plumb line. The plumb line, we can adjust the screws out here, these screws out here and make the plumb line straight so that the balance shows the middle point. We can adjust the screws and balance it, make the plumb line straight so that the pointer shows the midpoint. Here are the weights in grams and this is in milligram. In this box we have weights in milligram. Milligrams are so small that we use a forcep to make pick up one of the weight and the weight is actually written on top of these thin sheets which we cannot see now but uh, actually it is visible. Spring balance works on the principles of moment of force. Now we are going to weigh this bob. We kept it on the left pan. There is no movement because we did not lift it up. As we lift up, we can see that the other pan goes up, which shows that the left pan is heavier. Now we are going to balance. We start with the 50 gram weight. You can see it is written 50. We put it on the right pan and then weigh. Now we can see 50 is heavier than the bob. The weight is heavier than the bob, so we change. Now we try with 20. Here we find that even 20 is heavier than the bob. So now we try with 10. Now we find that the bob is heavier than the weight. That means we have to add some more weight to find the weight of the bob. We are trying with 15. 15 is again heavier than the bob. So we have to take something less than 15. Now we are trying with 12, the weight is 10 plus 2, 12, even 12 is heavier than the bob. So we try with 11, the small weight is 1 gram. Now we find that the bob is heavier, that means it is 11 gram some thing more than 11 gram. Now we are going to use milligrams. We are going to take this 500 milligram and weigh. With 500 milligrams, it shows that the bob is more. That means it is 500 plus some more weight. Now we are trying with 500 milligram plus 200 milligram. Then also we find that the pointer starts moving towards the right only. It is not coming towards the left. That means it is little heavier than the bob is little heavier than the weight. Now we are trying with 20 milligram. With 20 milligram, we can see that the bob is balanced. That means the weight of the bob is 20 milligram. How do we know that it is balanced? Because the pointer shows the midpoint. Here we can see it is at the middle. That shows that both the pans are 
balancing each other. So the weights are 50 plus 1, 51 grams and the rest are in milligram. This is 500, this is 200 and this is 20. So 720 milligram, 51 grams and 720 milligrams is the weight of the bob.